Hey guys, what is going on? So first of all, I just want to say thank you guys so much for 10,000 10,000 subscribers, dude. Like what? 10,000 of you guys hit the subscribe button. That's there's something in my eye. Oh my. But yeah, guys, anyways, 10,000 is absolutely insane. So I just want to, yeah, so I just want to say thank you guys so much for hitting the subscribe button. Thank you guys for the support. Everything, honestly, commenting, hitting that like button, subscribing, just supporting the channel in general. I really do appreciate it. Um, we're just getting started, dude. We're honestly just getting started with the 10K. So anyways, guys, in this video, I'm going to be unboxing and reviewing Unbox Therapy's case. I'm sure a bunch of you guys already kind of know about this case. Um, it, this case costs $39. I got it from my iPhone 12 Pro. There's no shipping and there's no tax included so it's literally just $39 anyways guys yeah so I heard a lot about this case um obviously on Bucks Therapy talks about this case pretty much every single video and I would too if I made a case as well and as you guys know I'm a, I'm a huge package guy if the packaging is good I'm, I'm probably going to be satisfied with the product so um I got this a couple days ago it took like a couple days to get delivered um ooh is a very high end what is this what is this oh like i said guys packaging is a huge thing for me if the packaging is good i'm probably gonna like the product but on the front of the package we get just a, a kind of image this is like a glossy kind of image of the product i don't know if this is a sticker what is this is this a sticker then possibly thin phone case for the iphone 12 pro and then we open it up like this hopefully you guys can see this and oh and you just pull it out like this no paperwork, because they don't need a paperwork for a case. Um, this case is 0.6 millimeters thin. Featherweight, it's only 10 grams, stronger than steel. I don't know about that one, but this is a this is probably the lightest case I've ever held. It feels like I'm feeling, this feels like literally a feather. They were right. This honestly, it's crazy, dude. This is way lighter and thinner than I thought it was gonna be. And I got the, the cyber edition case this is very similar to the th world's thinnest case that i unboxed we're going to put it in the case hmm the weight is a little bit lighter on this case which is crazy to think about because i don't know how you can get lighter than the case that i unboxed earlier but yeah this honestly feels like i don't even have a case on this phone to be completely honest the thing that is kind of weird that isn't you don't really see in many cases is the back of the phone where the cameras are. As you guys can see, each individual camera hole is cut out of the case. So for me personally, I don't know if I'm, I like this or not. I mean, it does feel kind of nice in the back, to be honest. It does feel kind of nice, like just touching the camera, but I don't really know how I feel about how it looks. Another thing is this thing has cutouts everywhere on the phone. And so there's no buttons. You're actually pressing the, the actual physical phone button with this case with most cases you know like the iphone leather case right here like we have um they have metal buttons obviously this is a thicker case and probably a way more protective case as well honestly if i drop this on the floor this would probably crack my phone i don't think this would do anything with drop protection just like the the thinnest case i unboxed a couple a couple days ago a couple weeks ago uh, this is kind of just for scratches but the thing about this case is that the cutouts are absolutely insane on every cutout of the phone. So I feel like it's not even helping in that category either because if you have the stainless steel iPhone, that's kind of what you want to protect. If you get a case, you kind of want it to protect all sides like the Apple leather case. It protects pretty much every single side of the iPhone. I do like the carbon the carbon fiber texture and the feel. Carbon fiber is a very light material and this is probably like the thinnest case and lightest case that I've ever put on my phone. And like I said, it doesn't even feel like there's a case on my phone right now. For drop protection, this is not gonna do anything, I honestly don't think. I think carbon fiber is a very strong material. I don't know if this is real carbon fiber. I'm not 100% sure. Um, the texture I like. I like the texture on it a lot. So it literally says that it is addictive to touch. I would say it is addictive to touch. The thing that I really do like about this case is that it has a lip around the entire front of the case. So basically, if you wanna put the phone on the table, like face down on the table, you're gonna be pretty much set because it's not gonna actually touch your physical screen it's actually going to touch the lip of the case around the whole front of the phone which is a good feature hey okay, guys is this case worth 39 dollars us um 
I honestly think the materials on it are the materials are very good but if you want a good protective case I would say this is probably not it I would say this is probably for the people that just want a cool looking iPhone and don't really care that much about the protection of the phone which doesn't really make sense because it is, it is a case but I just think the cutouts are too big for for this iPhone especially the pro model because like I said this thing is going to get absolutely scratched up. It's going to be pretty much like you don't ha really have a case in the phone because of how big the gaps and the cutouts are on this case. So I would say that this case is probably worth not probably not $39. I think it is a little bit overpriced at the $39 price tag. I would say probably $29, maybe like $34. I think 39 is probably a little bit too expensive. It is cheaper than an Apple case, but then again, Apple cases are a lot more protective and a lot, I, th I would say, a higher quality uh, than this later case. But the Apple cases are definitely not as thin as this case. So if you, were gonna, if you want a really nice, thin, minimal, won't really do much if you drop it, case and this is the perfect case for you if you want to spend 39 dollars on a case but yeah guys that's pretty much it thank you guys for watching I, again thank you guys so much for 10,000 subscribers like i said this is the start we're gonna keep going we're gonna keep grinding and hopefully you guys are gonna keep supporting the channel because i really do appreciate it if you enjoyed this video and helped you out please drop a like and subscribe guys really help with the channel i'll see you guys in the next video peace